Okay, probably my favorite beat to date for a lot of different reasons. Uh, what happened was my boy gave me a copy of this synth that I can't even remember off the top of my head. I don't know what, why I can't remember what this thing was called. But basically at the time, it was like the most powerful soft synth you could get. And at the time when we had it, I couldn't even, you couldn't launch it and have anything else open because I didn't have a computer strong enough to play this thing as a VST. You know what I mean? So it was like, I had to shut everything off and then launch this thing and play it. And the funny thing was, even some of the preset sounds I couldn't even use because as soon as you hit a key, it would crash it because of the, the, the computer wasn't strong enough to compute all the synth data that was going on in this thing. I can't, I, I don't know why I can't remember what this thing is called. Hold on, let me see. It was called Massive. How the hell do you forget a name like Massive? So anyway, the synth is called Massive. And so what I would do is launch the synth and then, uh, you know, play the sounds. And so I play the sound and bounce it out and uh, took the bounce in and chopped it up. And I just called it Super Fat Move because uh, it was a basic synth. So what I did was the synth, this is what the synth sounds like. I just played it with no corner sizing or anything. I, I just had a program that uh, uh, could record what my computer was doing. So I was recording what this computer was doing. And then I just started playing different synth noises and stuff. And so this was a pattern I came up with. So then I slowed it down, you know, I chopped it up and recycled, brought in the reason, slowed down, compressed it a little, and then this is what I came up with. So you can even hear in the timing a little bit where it's off, like I hit another key or something, because I was goofing off. So you can see the timing, this is all jacked up. So, uh, you know, I brought it in as is. Uh, for the drums, Isaac Hayes break, and then uh, just rebuilt a new chorus out of out of it. it. You know, put some stuff in there, gunshot noises, uh, you know, some scratch noises. Uh, oh no, not a gunshot noise. Old Dirty Bastard sample and some some other samples and stuff, and ended up making this. Vocals are squeeze Glock. So anyway, it was pretty simple, you know, just a sample, some drums, or not even a sample, but a synth, you know, and uh, it was, it's my favorite beat. I like the way it sounds, but it's kind of frustrating too, because this is one of the easiest beats I did because I didn't have a process or nothing. I just sat down with the synth, played something that I like, brought it in, then added drums and stuff, and then later auditioned the beat to this uh, Nas, you know, classic Nas track, Got Yourself a gun and then it ended up working out and it ended up being dope and I, I threw it up in a couple forms and right away everybody was like wow man those synths sound ill and all that stuff and so it's one of my favorite beats but it's also a frustrating beat for me because it, I wish they came this easy to me all the time this track just kind of happened and so anyway download it enjoy it uh, inside the kit it's got you know the reason file some of the other samples that I used and of course that that particular synth noise so if you want to use that synth for something man if you do something with it and you like it feel like sharing it, man, shoot it at me. I'm in the thread at gmail.com.